I'm Juliet Weir Jones, Vice President of Career Key. In this video, we'll talk about how to use the new features of LinkedIn alumni to explore careers and college majors. Whether you're considering a career change or you're just starting to look at career choices, LinkedIn can help broaden your knowledge about what's possible by looking at what people have done in their careers. All you need is a free LinkedIn account. Because LinkedIn alumni is organized around schools and fields of study instead of occupations and careers, it's really best used to see what careers are possible with a particular major. And despite the word alumni, anyone can use the tool, college graduate or not. So let's get started. First, click on LinkedIn alumni. You need to choose a college or university to begin your search. It's great that you don't have to be a school's graduate or current student to see information about its graduates. It could be a school you're interested in attending, a big university nearby for a more regional picture, or a school you attended. So although I didn't graduate from North Carolina State University, I can still see what their graduates studied or majored in, their skills, the types of work they do, and where they work. So first, look at the types of jobs listed for a field of study, exploring those that interest you. Click on what, what they studied in the fourth column over. You'll see the graph adjust and narrow to graduates of that field. I chose social sciences. Notice that the study choices can be broad, like social sciences, which includes economics and sociology, or it can be very specific, like chemical engineering. You can also start by narrowing results based on the type of job first, like the what they do column, and then the field of study. If you're already focused on careers in education, then start there. Next, notice the types of skills most listed by graduates in a field of study. So when you're looking at the fields of study, you know, what people study, notice the column next to it called what they're skilled at. Take a note of the skills that you have on that list and those that you don't. This will give you ideas for ones to focus on and strengthen later. Next, after choosing categories of what they do and what they study, Look at individual job titles and profiles by clicking on the third connections plus everyone else, which is in the how you are connected column. Scroll down to see the people listed. Are there any job titles that interest you? Are there any job titles that surprise you? Consider these people as possible sources for information interviews. Even if the person lives far away or there's no realistic way to make a connection to them, you might search locally for someone similar, working in a similar kind of job. To avoid getting overwhelmed by information, you'll need to tailor your search to what interests you most. For example, you could get indicators of, about job outlook in certain geographic areas by looking at where they live, and the most popular employers by looking at where they work. The best thing to do is just dive in, look, and play around with it. Thanks for watching! Be sure to return to the Career Keys YouTube channel and follow us on LinkedIn and Facebook for other videos and tutorials.